Thought I heard somebody, but no, just my imagination. Oh, I gotta go over there. There's a thing, Bob. I think that was a good use of one of those. How dare you list to the right? Or left, or whatever direction you were heading. How dare you? Thermos? More shotgun shells. I think I'll go ahead and start using my shotgun. And a flashbang. Whoa! I think if I'm quick on my flashlight. I was gonna say, we're having some fucking Dark soul shit here. <laughs> Alright, let's switch back to our... Flares, because those are pretty good in these situations. Ooh. Speaking of which, those are always handy. Seriously, another batch? I was a country mile away. I don't know why you slow down. Holy fuck. Never gonna catch me. Forget about it. Uh oh. You might catch me if I run into that. Ow! They caught me. Okay. Seriously, guys. That was painful as shit. And used up a lot of resources. I'd say that wasn't worth it, but we got a thermos, which is always worth it. Ah, that's the stuff. That's right, turn on your hot lights. Freeze fall, everyone dies. In the same direction I was going, a cold feeling settled itself in the pit of my stomach. Was it going for Alice? Was it going for a cheeseburger? No one could be sure. The graveyard shift may cause cancer. To say the graveyard shift may cause cancer? Oh, another speed demon. Out, a little too early. Ow, my ass. Fucking Russians. Listen, you're not being cute, you're being annoying. Get back here. You know, I see you're back there. Our residents are trying to nap! Only three more shots in the old boomstick. Let's go ahead and put that away. Well, nature's calmed down now, so maybe we won't be facing a billion dudes. More batteries. I suppose I'll use this.
Huh. It's probably where it was supposed to go, I'm not sure. Or maybe not. Hmm. Oh, whatever. The place was dead. A ghost town. Had been for decades, maybe a century. Ow! Fucking god damn it! Ow! My face! Almost got my head taken off by a fucking car there. Those things are really hard to goddamn dodge. How do I get in this structure? It looks like it's bored up, but... There's probably things in there. Things? No, I guess maybe not. Huh. What a weird place. Oh, I could just jump through the window here. Maybe. No? Oh, so man, those windows are clear. All right, what tales do you hold? Things were never as simple in real life as in fiction. I had lost count of the times I had wished there'd be a clear reason for my writer's block. Something to fight. Something to lash out on. There wasn't. I was filled with doubt. I was nothing like the hero in my books. Alex Casey had gone through his life with single-minded determination, never wavering from his goal. Even now, I was angry at myself. Angry at Alice. Angry at Barry. I was fumbling and I had no plan. So angry. Wait. Another point of return. What you gotta tell us? Grey Peak Gorge. Originally founded in 1928, the Grey Peak Gorge mining town was one of the permanent settlements the Bright Falls Mining Company built for its workers. The nearby graveyard is a testament to the dangers to the miners, or the dangers the miners faced on a daily basis. Most of the men who lost their lives over the years were buried there. Well, just buried there. A grim reminder to be careful for those who remained. Great Peak Gorge was abandoned almost overnight when, Bra when the Brett Falls Mining Company closed its doors in 1970. There's things. I like things. Batteries. Why not bullets? I need bullets. Why can't I have a gun that shoots energizers? Ooh, another thermos. Alright. What's on this one? I actually didn't do the other one either. Just trying to think of a topic I haven't covered, really. Can't remember what my favorite one is. Oh, you got that one, Bobo? Excellent work. I was going to say, I'm looking back in the log. I don't see it. Oh, it had U.S. acres on it? Excellent. Great. More of this. But wait, there's more. Call now and get more shaking dark stuff. Ow! Okay, good. Actually, I have a pretty good position over here. Alright, let's go pick up some batteries. No wonder there's so many fucking batteries around here. Oh, we need the player to be full of batteries. If they're not full of batteries, they're gonna have trouble with this.
Pick it up. Alan. Alan. It's right there. There you go. Sure thing, Bobo. I always appreciate your input. On the thermos, uh, thermosology, or naming, whatever. You know. This, the last thermos we picked up was Army Surplus. It's a dent that makes you wonder how it got there. Maybe a bullet hit it. Maybe it was hit with a trench tool. Or maybe it deflected a thrown grenade by the enemy. No one's really sure. Either way, it's pretty beaten up. Can't even see what's trying to throw itself at me. There you go. Another one bites the dust. Hey. Keys. Probably going there. Is there anything else? Oh, well, there's a little mine shaft. I bet that has something cool in it. <gasps> Thermos. Hmm. The only the thing that's coming to my mind right now is just like sports. Uh, well, no, no, you gotta do something other than sports. Sports is too easy. I'm not sure which one I'm proud of the most though. I think I like the George or the uh, the Nixon one it was pretty good. They also like the uh, the Seinfeld one as well. Writing is a struggle. I feel ill. I managed to make my way downstairs. There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake, using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs. I'll borrow these things for my story. They ring true. They fit. Yeah, as, uh... I was gonna say, who pointed out? As Marte points out, I was killed by a bulldozer. I also drove a, uh, a car off a cliff. For, uh, scientific purposes. I think I died in another way as well. Ooh, hunting rifle. Uh, hunting rifle or my shotgun? How much do I have shoot gun? Not that much. Hunting rifle has 11. It wins. You like how bored he looks watching that TV with himself on it? Yeah, you'd think he'd show a little more emotion, like, holy shit. But he's really just falling in the stride. He's all, oh, another TV with me on it. Big fucking whoop. <sighs> Yellow paint. The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up. Oh, I'll hurry up after I get this cache full of goodies. Ooh, man, it is just throwing, throwing the flare gun ammo at me. I am not unhappy with that. Up, 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 up. Man, there's a sheer peak up there. That people love climbing whatever that one is. Oh great, more demon birds. birds. Fucking hate birds.
I think it'd like them to come towards me before I try to cross there. No, they don't wanna. Whoa, baby. Okay, that one's broke. This one gonna try their luck? They thinking about it. Yeah, you. Come on, break it up. There we go. I'm pretty sure they're broken up now, too. And there would have to be more underneath this son of a bitch. Whoa, those ones just appeared behind me. Those ones are pretty sneaky trying to get me at that low angle. Well, the birds can't get me now. Wait. Oh, and this is a silver mine unlike the other one, which was a coal mine, of course. Don't know what's in the air. Stinks like sulfur in here. Also, what the hell? Thought I saw something on the other side there, like a thermos. What is it, voice and head? Tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. Do I want to go that way? I think so. I'm coming. It's gonna have a trap in here. Isn't it? It's gonna say, you're stuck in here with me. Without warning, the headache stabbed at my brain. Whoa. All kinds of turned around there. Alice? I'm coming, baby. Edge? I'm losing it. I gotta get out of here. First, we gotta get the page. Hunter's Alice taken. Big, thick-set men, confident and at home in the woods. They were feeling good, running on beer, ghost stories, and camaraderie late into the night. It did them no good, as they were taken by the dark presence, sucked deep into a darkness far worse than any ghost story they ever told or heard. Neat. Yeah, I don't think I can go any further. They gave me a checkpoint just in case I did want to jump in. Well, let's fucking jump in then. I want to swim. Alice! <laughs> you don't have the flashlight, you have a bat signal? Pretty much. If only your flashlights had uh, light penetration like this. Alright. Is there anything down here? Nope. Alright, let's head on up. Come on now. More flares. Game saying, I hope you're using these because I'm giving them to you. I think we have another boss coming up actually. Even behind the closed doors and curtains of his grimy room at the Majestic, the local motel, Nightingale could feel the locals' eyes on him, the unrelenting pressure of their judgment. 
he forced it out of his mind. For all he knew, they could all be under Wake's spell already. You do what you have to do to get the job done. He took comfort from the bottle in his hand. Please, he thought. Just let me get through this. More stuff. Hey, more pistol ammo. And hunting rifle ammo. Looks like a little tunnel there. Oh, hello. Ow! Take one of these, asshat. Back! Back, child of Satan! Back from whence you came! Son of a bitch! No, fuck you. What? There he goes. You fucking chicken shits throwing that crap. Where the hell they come from? <laughs> like that way caved in, and then, of course, hmm. Ooh, a thermos. Well, this is an interesting one, because this one, well, is as old as the 70s. It seems to be disco themed. It has the word staying alive on it. I like going that way. I'd have to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Ah, oh, yes, I remember this. Could help me with that. Nah, I'm sure it won't, Al. Do people really get around in mines using convoluted bullshit like this? They must. A video game would never have anything unrealistic. What the fuck is this? Hmm. I think I'm supposed to jump across to the place on the right. Ooh, yeah. I see two ways to go. It's over here. We have that and we have the one up there. Okay. <laughs> Game your... Puzzleroos are nothing compared to what I've seen. Seems like there should be something cool over there. Maybe there is. Yep, looks like there is. Let's take the fast way down. <laughs> 